Hello everyone! Today I'm going to show you how to download BorrowBox audiobooks with your Whitehorse Manningham library card. BorrowBox is an easy to use digital audio and ebook platform that lets you choose from thousands of titles. Your library membership allows you to download up to four titles at a time. The loan period is three weeks after which the item is automatically returned. There is also an option to return the books at any time. BorrowBox can be downloaded to your computer through the library website and played on your computer's media player. But today I'll be showing you the more practical method of downloading to the app to play on your mobile device, such as a smartphone or tablet. To download the books this way, you will first need to download the BorrowBox app. The app is available from both the Apple App Store or the Google Play Store for Android devices. In this demonstration, I am using an iPhone. So I open the App Store, search for BorrowBox, all one word and then tap the cloud or the get icon to install. Once the app is fully installed, it will appear on the home screen of your device. You will then be prompted to register an account and sign in with your library ID. First of all, you'll need to search for our library. So type in Whitehorse Manningham and select it when it appears. Next, type in your library card number and library PIN or password. If you've forgotten your PIN, just go to the library website and under the My Account heading, follow the instructions to reset your PIN. Agree to the terms and conditions and click on the Agree button in the bottom right hand corner. To complete the registration, you will be prompted to enter your email address and display name as well as an option to receive newsletters and notifications. OK, the registration process is now complete and you can now begin searching. You'll start on the My Loans page, which in future will contain a record of your loans and reservations. All of the options for navigating the app will appear in the taskbar at the bottom at the bottom of the screen. To begin browsing, click on the e audiobooks button. Within the browsing page, you can narrow down your search by age level. Within these age levels, you can also narrow it down further by category, genre. The next option in the taskbar is the ebook catalogue. The library also subscribes to a select number of ebooks.
these can also be viewed in the app. If you wish to search for a specific author or title, tap on the search button. Begin your search. And once you've selected a title, click on the image and then tap on the green borrow button in the bottom right corner. Then tap on the green download button. The book will now appear under loans on the My Loans page and the return date will be displayed on the right hand side with an option to return at any time or renew later on. Keep in mind that a book can only be renewed if nobody else has reserved it. To continue searching, tap on the search button again at the bottom of the page and type in your search. If the book is on loan, you may like to reserve it. To do that, click on the image and then click on the orange reserve button. The reservation will now appear on your My Loans page under your loans. Finally, the settings screen displays your account details and where you'd go if you want to change any of the information. That's all for today. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoy using BorrowBox. And if you have any further questions, please contact the library.